Okay, today is going to be a really fun video because what I got here, I got some Alexandria Arms 50 Bay Wolf ammo. They are the creators of the 50 Bay Wolf. I'm pretty sure, at least the uppers, or they had, I'm pretty sure they're the ones that made it. Anyway, uh, so they had a couple boxes of this at the local gun store. This is a 200 grain. It's like, on a website, I'll try to put a thing here. It's a metal filled plastic or something like that, composite, I don't know. They're going 2,500 feet per second. They kind of look like it. Kind of hard to tell on the camera. It looks like there's some copper in there. Pretty wild bullet. For 2,500 feet a second, we will be checking it with a chronograph. We'll be trying it on the steel down there. And then I got the 100 pound lead block. And then I also have some uh, pute putes that need destroyed. Uh, so if you ever <laughs> want to come shoot some uh, data with me with a 50 cal, let me know. So let me quit talking, get set up, and see what these guys do. Okay, we've got the chronograph set up there. I got two rounds. A lot of people ask me what mags I use for this. This is called a hex mag. They work. They're made for a 50 Bay Wolf 300 or 223. I use it for all of them, and they work really well. So we've got two rounds. We'll see for cycles. Chambered good. And let's see if we get a... I should put something behind here. We'll just go feet per second here. Right, I'll see if I can zoom in to see. 2410. So that's pretty good. And it did. Let me zoom back out here. And it did cycle. So very good. All right. So yeah, 2400 feet per second. That's ripping for a 50 cal out of an AR. So let's try a couple targets. Okay, I got two more rounds in here. This is an 18 inch barrel, 20 to the tip there. So I'll zoom you in. We'll shoot the elephant first to the right over there. And then we'll shoot the lead block there. So let me move you guys right about there. All right. See what she does to the elephant. <laughs> Dude, it laid that elephant out, man. It ripped the screws out of the freaking wood. All right, let's try a lead block here. I see a mat. Yeah, you can see it down there. And it locked open, so all good. So, whoa. <laughs> wow, look at that hole. That thing is insane. <laughs> Dude, that is nuts, man. It just dissipated all that energy. It just completely blew that round to pieces that would be like one heck of a self-defense round i mean you get hit with that you're done five 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 you're done brother let's check out mr elephant here rip the screws out yeah they even hit so it must be copper it must be copper in there yep i even hit high too like if i hit low i can see it ripping the screws out more but it yeah, it laid that out. So, that's still so impressive, man. Oh, I thought maybe the bullet did so much shit here. But yeah, I think it just completely disintegrated on that 100 pound block of lead. Pretty awesome. So let's try the computers, I guess. Okay, I've got two more rounds in here. I got the computers down there. We'll zoom you guys in. Microwave, I'll try to do two shots. Chambered already. All right. Try to do two shots. See if it survives. Oh, right in the center. The gun shoots so good. All right. Let's go see what happened. Okay. Perfect shots. Yep. Oof. Oof. I can smell data being destroyed here. Oh, yeah. It went through both, though. I mean, I knew a regular one would. And look at them holes back there. I should have brought up more. I got a bunch more. Maybe we'll try that in another video. So, thanks for watching, guys. Catch you next one.